Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be taking you guys through the six steps that I take to revive my wigs. So if you want to see how I do that, keep on watching. So this is the hair that we're starting off with. It is super matted and a tangled mess. It is dry, it is brittle. Um, I literally have not worn either of these two wigs in a couple of months. And instead of hanging them so that they do not get super tangled i just threw them in a box and created havoc for myself um, i've had these wigs for about a year and some change as you can see the lace has some glue on it still and this is that was my straight hair it has a bit of wave though after you wash it and this is my brazilian curly and as you can see the glue on the lace as well so i'm gonna need to work on that so y'all in this video i'm pretty practically going to show you how i revive this wig from the dead honey because it is currently deceased i'm just going to take you guys through the products that i use i use two main things and it's the l'oreal paris alvive extraordinary oil in the curl nourishment conditioner and the curl nourishment shampoo why do i use this i use it because it works okay it really penetrates the hair guys it smells amazing and leaves your hair super soft super detangled and just honestly manageable all right um this shampoo and conditioner have amla oil and six precious uh, flower oils and it basically nourishes your hair it defines the curl and it has a vibrant shine i use this on my straight wigs as well because as you know you get it straight and then you wash it and it's a bit wavy and because this is an intensive repair treatment i also go in with my original hair mayonnaise which treats weak and damaged hair guys just to further penetrate the hair and make sure we get it as super soft and manageable as possible and this is also an african best um brand which i like to use because it's organic and it has extra virgin olive oil in it not only that but it also has um, an egg protein and natural herbs this which is what we are really looking for in this intensive repair treatment that we're about to do on our wigs so let's get to the washing process guys hi guys so the first step is to shampoo that hair so we're gonna add just enough water so that the hair can be submerged and then we're gonna go ahead and add our shampoo i don't add too much because a little bit goes a long way and then i'm going in with my hand just to help the shampoo dissolve into the water and then here i am adding just a little bit more because i want my hair to be squeaky clean of oh, that hot mess then I'm using my hand again to help dilute. Now I'm gonna submerge the wig within the water. Make sure it's completely submerged because you want the shampoo to work and penetrate the hair. Then we're gonna let the hair sit for 30 minutes. 30 minutes is enough. If you wanna leave it for more, you certainly can. So now we are on step number two. Doing good guys. And this step is fairly simple and self-explanatory. We are just going to rinse all of that shampoo out of the hair and that's it. Okay guys, we are on step number three and this is targeting the problem area. The lace y'all, the lace. Ensuring that all the glue, oops, oops, see, that's a bit of glue. We need to make sure all that glue is off so i'm just going to add a little bit of soap to the lace directly if you've got a little brush to help you with this process you can but as you can see i'm just gently scrubbing with my hands it's in it's sped up so it looks like i'm being a little rough but i am completely gentle honey and then we're going to rinse it out and as you can see the lace is clinked it is clinked Whew. once that lace is clean honey we are moving on to the conditioner and hair mayonnaise we are going to saturate this hair with hair mayonnaise as well as conditioner i am mixing the two of them okay because this is intensive <laughs> repair recovery sos and then we are not going to finger detangle okay the hair is fragile it is tangled we are just simply gently coating the hair with the conditioner okay yes honey go to work go to work go to work 
Um, so I ended up actually using my whole freaking, what is that? The tap to help me hold the hair so that I can further just ensure that I've saturated each and every piece of this hair, honey. Especially the curly one, guys. Tangles on curly hair can be demonic. So make sure that you get every single strand of that hair, okay? Coated with hair mayonnaise. And here we're gonna let it sit for another 30 minutes on its own little work. Okay guys, so now that you've let the conditioner and the hair mayonnaise sit on the hair for 30 minutes, the hair is softer and ready to detangle. So I just, as you can see, I'm going in with a wide tooth comb and I am combing from the ends up to the roots and I'm really, really taking my time because like I said, the hair was a matted, dry ass mess and <laughs> just need to be careful and just take your time with it And now all good things come to those who wait. Here is the finished product, super detangled, super moisturized. Now we're moving on to the curly wig. I'm just spritzing it with some water mixed with conditioner. And then we're going to follow the same procedure as the straight wig. And here is the finished super detangled wig. Oh snap, what was that? And the, oh. I know you heard that too yep that was the church bell ringing and the church choir singing we have made it to the sixth and final step and it's pretty self-explanatory we are just rinsing out all the product out of the hair and then we're gonna hang our hair to dry okay and you can hang it indoors in a well ventilated room or if you're feeling a little brave honey you can hang it outside to air dry and that's it now, I don't mean to toot my own horn, honey, but the hair is looking super luscious and soft, isn't it? Now, if you did not know, now you know, honey, that the devil is a liar. We started off with a hot, hot mess. The hair was super tangled, super dry, and matte to the core, guys. Ew. But luckily for us, the Lord is good and if you followed all six steps that are outlined in this video then your hair should be looking this fantabulous their hair smells amazing it is soft and tangle free and it currently does not have any added product in it and I did this on purpose because I'm gonna be filming another video on how I lay and slay my wigs honey and if you enjoyed this video be sure to like comment and subscribe to your girls channel okay and click on the notification bell so that you can be notified when I post, when I upload another video, okay? And this is your girl, Annie, signing out.